This was taken with that Optio S camera, that small one. Right. And it looks like it's on canvas, right? Yeah. Yeah. And that's $110. That one's 110 And yeah. that has that laminate canvas finish. Okay. These are my sunflowers. So why do you uh, like doing the flowers? I always like flowers. When I was a little girl, I always had flowers in my hand. And I like flowers because they don't complain. <laughs> Well, and the I, colors too. I like the colors, and I, you can be so creative with flowers. You can do a lot of neat stuff with them, you know. And, and they all have their personalities, you know. They have pre you know, if you notice, you know, they're so cheerful. And, yeah. You know, yeah. Do, do, do you follow other uh, photographers? I mean, I mean, I mean, do you have any um, favorite photographers you like to I, I watch? I like uh, Tom Magnuson. You know, have you heard of him? Huh. He's an incredible photographer. He does a lot of, you've seen the polar bears, like the white polar bears. Uh -huh. and so he's done stuff like that. He takes a lot of his stuff in Alaska and in Africa. And, he's, and I, I don't know, I don't really follow. I just do. You what, just do it? I just do it, you know. I had somebody ask me, well, well how do you, know, what do you do? So you just do it. <laughs> I, I, and do you, do you do any you know, reading, you know, try to um, make yourself better in photography or you just, like you said, you just do it, right? I just do it, you know. I mean, I, you know, I'll do different settings on my camera. Right. But um, as far as spending hours waiting for the perfect image, I don't have the patience for that. Yeah, okay. <laughs> oh, I was going to ask you that too. Yeah, no. I, yeah. 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 So, okay. And you know, and like these, th those were taken with um, my Olympus, you know. Okay. And that's in front of St. Luke's. Yeah. yeah. And do you like doing fruit or flowers, or do, what do you like? What, what's your subject? What, what, what do you like doing the most? Well, I, you know, actually, I like the flowers the most, and I like the fruit and the vegetables too. And I, I like scenery. You know, it's scenery. Is, I, I just like nature, so. Yeah. 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 Basically, I like nature, so I started with the flowers because it's so convenient. Do so. <laughs> you ever go any groups of uh, photographers and just go uh, take pictures all at once no. and nothing, no. and have fun? I'm not into that. Not in the groups. I'm, okay. I'm, kind of, I'm not a groupie. You know, I'm. A, I just like to go out there, do it on my own. I'll go maybe with one other person. But yeah. I don't want to go with a group because I want to have. You know, I want images that everybody else is not going to have. Right. I mean, okay. You, I mean, there's always that chance. But, you know, yeah, you know, yeah. Like the train depot, I'm sure there's a you know, million of those. Well, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but how many, now, how many people are going to have this? Now, if I had ten people with me, there might have been ten other people with that. Butterfly and the bee. Yeah. And you know, a lot of people ask me, well, how long did you wait for that? I says, well, was it just their show back? So lucky. <laughs> <laughs> oh, look at it. Yeah. Well, good. And then. Um, I did a, I do a lot of hiking. Okay. I, yeah, I was going to ask mm -hmm. you if you do hiking, because it looks like you, you, you have to, to yeah. take these, these pictures. And, and last summer I did bring my canning on hikes with me. The big, big gun. Big yeah, gun, yeah. yeah. <laughs> and what I have, I have like a harness, so it's not around my neck, so right. the, the pressure is on, more on my back and shoulders, and so, yeah, I should show you that. Yeah, um, and you got some good pictures from that. I mean, oh, yeah, did, yeah. Okay, now this is, um, this is just north of Ketchum. Remember the big fire two years ago? Uh-huh. Um, that is the result of the fire. Those are wild hollyhocks. Oh. Yeah, and I have another photo here. I, I also have matted stuff and unmatted stuff. But doesn't certain flowers come up after a, a burn? Yeah. And those are the but just to give you an example. Yeah. Yeah, and I always look for the unusual. And here's a large one of that one. 
Yeah. Oh, that's pretty, yeah. You know, I look for the unusual, you know, have a bunch of Falls. When it's at its peak? Mm -hmm. After yeah, yeah. only two weeks of the year. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. But just to give you an example, you know, I kind of like to have these out. I like to explain this to people. Yeah, yeah, explain. Yeah. Okay. The fire was in 2007. Okay. Okay. 2008, I went hiking. I was hiking and I came across this grove of trees that got burnt by the fire. And it was really eerie. And this is what, you know, the little growth here is starting to come up. In 2009, I went up there and you know, just approximately the same place. And you have, oh, it's just absolutely gorgeous. It's hollyhocks. What's, yeah, it's how, yeah, I love how the nature. Yeah, yeah. It charges itself, they, I guess. I mean, they're about this tall and you have the black trees. And, have you sold many of those? I, yeah, I sell a lot of these. You know, these, this is a good seller. Is it? Yeah, because the contrast of the... Oh yeah, the, the dark yeah. and lights and, yeah. and um, you probably sold a lot up in... Up, in up there, oh yeah, picture. especially, yeah. yeah, what happened is, thank God I got up there before everybody else did, because they were talking about the Holly Hawks. And once everybody found out about the hollyhocks, it was like Disneyland up there. Really? So, yeah. A lot of photographers and stuff like and that. And a lot of people just looking at them. Yeah. Yeah. Do, see, do you do commissions? I do. I'll have people, you know, if they want, say they'll see it in the mid channel. Oh, can you do that in 8 by 10 or 5 by 7 or larger? I can do that. Or. They'll say, well, I want a set of cards of just say, sunflowers, and I'll do that, and I'll do stuff like that. And, and how much, it, I know it all depends, but how much do you normally charge for that? I mean, because it well, varies. It, you know, it's not, I have the image already. Also, oh, okay, okay, I thought yeah. you meant you go out and actually take oh, if I whatever. Were, okay, if I go out, you know, I had, I was commissioned to photograph somebody's dog. Yeah. So I charge $50 an hour. Okay. That. And then I give them a CD of the photos. And no prints? If they want prints. And then it's more for prints. Right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. 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 And, and it goes on and on. It goes on. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, people are curious. I mean, if, they're, if they like your style, that's the reason oh, why yeah, I'm doing these yeah. videos, if they can, if you can get some jobs from it. Right, right. That's, that's the only reason. And then this one is on Harrison Boulevard. Yeah. Here, scoot, scoot down the reflection. There you go. There you go. That's good. Yeah. And where's that at again? That's on Harrison Boulevard. Ah. It's last fall. Cool. And if you would have looked, I didn't notice. I wish I would have seen it before. This little squirrel right there. <laughs> you know you should start doing is hiding squirrels in your, in your pictures. <laughs> <laughs> I should. <sure. laughs> that would be a little trademark. <laughs> yeah. You know, and I, you know, do things, you know, I, I do butterflies and another very, uh, big selling image is uh, the Sun Valley. You know, this is a, a field in, in Sun Valley. Uh -huh. And you're looking at towards all the mountain, but you know, you have the blue flats here. So. Yeah. yeah. That's the... And what I like to tell people is I'm in the same field here, but looking in the opposite direction, but a different year. <laughs> this was taken last year and this was taken. In the same that's probably the same area, right? Yeah, the same field.